From the moment he left Laclede, Missouri to enroll in West Point, General John J. Pershing dedicated his life to the military. He set himself apart from classmates for his marksmanship and leadership, and in 1886, he reported for active duty. He quickly earned a reputation for bravery and stern discipline in battles of the Indian and Spanish-American Wars. During this time, he suffered personal tragedy. A house fire took the lives of his wife and three young daughters. Only his six-year-old son survived. He did not let the grief keep him from building a legacy. President Woodrow Wilson saw such promise in Pershing that he appointed him as the commander of the American Expeditionary Force for the duration of World War I. Although he was initially frustrated by the slow-going progress of trench warfare, Pershing was credited with much of the success of World War I. To recognize his great contributions, the United States created a new title to rest on his shoulders, General of the Armies. This five-star ranking signified that he was the leader over Allied commanders. General Pershing was revered and feared as he went on to serve as a mentor to many of the great World War II military leaders. In his retirement, he published his memoir, My Experiences in the World War, which won a Pulitzer Prize for history. For his experience and leadership overseas and domestically, General John J. Pershing earned a page in world history.